Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh everyone Welcome to another introduction video about another course This time it's CSC Implementing Architecture ah, Never mind Computer Architecture As the title suggests that this will be designing architecture over here Well, I won't discuss much about that because that's our lecture 1, you know, the first video So this is just introduction about marks and stuff like that So let's discuss that later you have a prerequisite over here CSE 260 and let me add something CSE 260 is actually a prerequisite to four courses so it's a pretty important course you don't want to ignore this you don't go and take 230 and leave 260 you rather do 260 first because 230 is not a prerequisite to anything but this guy over here 260 is directly prerequisite of four courses and indirectly it can it is prerequisite of four more courses so eight courses are tied with this course so you don't want to underestimate CSE 260 better do it fast and the faculties that you have two fixed faculties SCH and BJU yes and that is so they're fixed actually you don't see other faculties there I don't know. at least this is spring 19 you won't be seeing anyways moving on about this course so the term computer architecture emphasizes the engineering decisions and trade-offs that must be made in order to produce a good design. Very formal definition. To put it simply, if I want to say this in one word, I will say that, you know, we did programming language, right? We run softwares and programs from this computer. As you can see, Microsoft PowerPoint itself is a program. Then again, there's a part that starts, that everything begins from, as soon as the power button is turned on, I click, uh, I don't click. I press the power button and things start working the bias shows up and then all these things then they write so many things your RAM is that your which is your boot whatever stuff like that very core things right so there is a hardware part which starts the machine and then there's the software part which helps me to in control the operating system and further storage and anything else so between this hardware and software there is some unique design and something between them which helps me to maintain the relationship between these two now this is for you to understand it's not any formal definition don't write that it's the thing that is between hardware and software to make good relationship between them in your exam you may even get zero so don't I, i'm just saying this for you to understand and we'll discuss this in the first video inshallah so no need to think about that and as for the lab there are no labs here but this is a you know this is a top course i will say if you are dedicated to computer you know you're passionate about computer science then you should be fine but if you're like okay i'm i'm here in csc for doing jobs and i want to get a good cvp or something being a good student won't help you here you really need passion to work through this you need understanding you need to use your own my how, how do i put this you need to be more practical and enthusiastic about this this is a tough course i'll tell you this and you really need to survive this then again if you're passionate you will get four inshallah so let's get this these are the contents which will not make any sense if you're seeing them for the first time but at least you know what's cash and you know overcoming data hazards so these are just have a look at them oh you won't even un uh, probably won't even understand but still you know i'll just tell you one thing this mips over here is median instructions per second oh, hope that helps this is the part you want to look at this may vary depending on faculty so that means it differs from GSR, DJU, and SCH. I mean, the one you have here is for SCH, sir. And he he actually, yeah, this is the one. He has five for attendance, quiz 25. Take a note of the quiz marks. It's big. Assignment 15. He's very serious about this. Viva 5. He may or may not take this, but the probability of taking is very high. Mid is 20. Final is 30. I think it was changed and from now it's mid 30 and quiz 15 and not even 15 quiz 10 and final 35 yep this is how it is now 
okay so that's the marks introduction video guys every single course introduction video is very small so that's all i have for you we'll start from lecture one and that's when the real deal begins inshallah happy surviving